Hi everybody, let's talk about palette one. This is probably my favorite unique eyeshadow palette and the reason being, I just think it is the most user friendly and especially for those of you that are starting off. Um, the colors are very neutral, there's a mix of shimmer, there's a mix of matte and there's some really beautiful gold tones that are gonna look awesome around the holidays. So. Let's get started. We are going to use our blending brush and we're going to use the color Chipper, okay? And this is a nice matte color. I'm just gonna flick some off a little bit. And I'm just going to use this as my transition color. And when we do our eyes, there are basically four different zones. We have our highlight color that goes under our brow, our transition color, which goes under that, our crease color, and then our lid color. So we're gonna start with the transition. And we're taking Chipper, and notice where I'm holding the brush, by the text. We don't need to hold it like a pencil that's gonna splotch too much color right onto our eyes. We wanna just have really loose, kind of wiggly control. So I'm on the brow bone, and I'm just windshield wipering this Chipper color back and forth on my brow bone. All right, so we have Chipper on our, as our transition color. And one of the things I also love about Chipper, this color right here, is you can use it to fill in your eyebrows. So you get a double whammy with this palette. Now, I am going to take my liner shader brush, and I'm going to take the color I'm going to take the color Brassy and we're going to use that on our lid. I'm kind of pressing my shader side into the Brassy and I'm going to spread that from corner to corner on my lid. But notice I'm patting it on. I don't want to swipe the color on because we're just going to end up swiping shadow all over our face. So we're Patting, sorry, <laughs> we're patting this color on. And I like to really get down into the tear duct to really lighten and brighten that inner corner. We want our brighter colors on the inside and our darker colors on the outside. So now we have Brassy on both eyelids. I am gonna add a little bit of zing to this. Um, I'm going to take the liner, the shader side of my brush, and I'm gonna dip it in just a little bit of water. I don't want it to be completely soaked, but I do want it a little bit damp. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this color Swanky, another shimmery gold color, I'm gonna take that dampened brush and press my brush into the color and I'm gonna put it on the inner, the center of my lid for some real pop because I love having shimmer on the lid because when I turn my head, it really catches the light and makes your eyes really noticeable. So I'm gonna pat that shimmer, that um, swanky. See that? Just on the inner, the center. Say inner. The center, all right? Let's get that damp up a little bit. And by dampening our brush, it's just making the colors really pop and stand out. And that, especially the shimmer ones. See how shimmery and noticeable my eyelids just got. All right, only one more step. We are going to take the dark color over here, uh, fourth right, and this is gonna be our crease color. We're taking our crease brush, patting it in, and we're gonna focus, we're gonna make an, a V on the outer corner of our eye, and then we're gonna bring it up onto our brow bone. And it's really important if you have hooded eyes that you bring this up on top of your lid. Don't put it in the crease. 
put it on top so that the colors are really seen and that's gonna make your eyes look bigger. So I just have this outer V done and then I kind of swirl it back and forth on the brow bone. And then I'm just gonna take a little bit more forth of that forthright and I'm gonna bring it under my eye. Kind of smoke it out a little bit. So on the inner corner I have that brassy color and then I've lined my eyes. So we're just making a V with the forthright and then bringing it up onto the brow bone. And we're gonna blend it all in. And that's it, that's our neutral gold smoky eye. And I'm gonna bring forthright under, underneath. I'm gonna blend it a little bit and then I'm gonna do my eyeliner and my mascara.